Oh, so I've been sat here for about five minutes, sort of almost contemplating what to say, really. But um, we are kind of considering changing my rooms. Kind of considering it now. Um, me and Caroline were kind of like talking after the weekend. Um, <laughs> well, you know the the, situ the, the scenario of the uh, the wing mirror. That was kind of uh, just almost like um, <laughs> it was almost like like the sort of almost like the final kind of straw. Really, I, I don't I don't know. We were kind of uh, can we can we sort of um, get back in. And uh, and we're str we're we're both really really struggling at the moment. To be fair, um, as regards the confidence issue with this this van, it, it it you you know the sort of torture we went through. I I, I know. I, don't get me wrong. Look, I know, you guys, you're going to be saying that um, everybody has their like scenarios, and and we've had so many people contact us about different issues similar kind of issues we've got a guy paul in northern ireland at the moment i, I, I think you're out of the way you're in definitely in ireland anyway and uh, he caught contacted me and that um has got a, his his van has just gone back into fiat and um uh, many sort of other people have like contacted me and um i'm, I'm just a little bit um well we've been um it is November the fifth. He has a few fireworks going off. Uh, we've been, we've we've had an absolute ball with this motorhome. We have, you know, this this is now just over five years old, and it's been an amazing journey. And uh, we, me and sort of Carolina, just sort of thinking like, are we ready for like another kind of? That's that's like hit another kind of maybe another make. Um, uh, so I, in fact, I did actually start um, the other day when we were having the uh, sort of uh, the, the the problem. It was sort of waiting for the problem to be sorted out. We were kind of like discussing it then. Really, to be honest, we were still kind of you know. Do you know what we've we sort of like what what is like the next step do do we sort of is it time to like make a break and um i did actually start thinking about a volkswagen the grand we we started looking a little bit at the grand california van i don't know if anybody's seen that one um so the volkswagen do one and obviously the man do one with a adri like they're using like adria as the um the van builder so i started having a look at the i'm thinking well it comes out of the like volkswagen have always got a pretty good name maybe someone's got a volkswagen that can change my um perspective on that um but anyway i started looking at it and thinking it comes out of the fact and we did a little bit of research we found out it's actually made in poland under like volkswagen the logo the name and uh, the obviously the scrutinization of volkswagen um corporation so um hopefully is it still a good anyway then um we did actually see one and uh, we we had a look at one and it was actually on an man which in the front of it looked a little bit it, it, it sort of looks a little bit basic inside the cab it's it's quite primitive inside the cab a little bit we thought i don't know if you guys have seen that um anyway i liked the look of the build quality in the back um Of the, so, so yeah where, where am i going here hang on yeah so this was an man and uh, so then i'm th kind of thinking but the back of it this one here was i've just got a little bit I've, I've literally got a little bit confused this this was actually an man uh exactly the same as the crafter and uh with the same kind of like uh internal fitments as this and I, and I was sort of looking at it thinking as the, as the volkswagen and then i started looking at it and it and it looked 
to be honest, it looked fairly good build quality. And uh, so I'm kind of like saying to Caroline, you know, I, I need to see what the, the this actual grand Californian is kind of like. And uh, we did actually see one in the showroom um, not far away from here, our, our, our local van centre place, but it was shut. It was on a weekend. We peered through the window and it was there. And we're kind of like, do you know what? You know, so it come like... So if it's actually made by Volkswagen as well, it must be a pretty good uh, product. Um, anyway, my first sort of like port of call then, I, I gave the guys a ring uh, this week and it didn't, it didn't actually go too well, to be honest. Um, they don't see many, uh, that's the problem. And the, the I, I was speaking to a girl and she, I said, like, are you, are you um, reception or like, so, like, I'm looking for like sales? She said, oh, I'm sales. And so I said like, Grand Californian. And it was a bit like, there was a bit of a delay in the answer. And she was like a little bit sort of, oh, um, I'm not sure. I said, you like know what it is? And she said, oh, I'm, I'm not too sure. We don't see many of them here. And it was totally the kind of like opposite reaction. I was hoping for some guy, literally a sales guy, to tell me how brilliant it was and, you know, give me some sort of like reassurance. And it just, it fell away. I said, literally, look, I'm going to like abandon this conversation. Um, this has not gone well. So that was kind of like the end of that. And um, since then, so so as it goes, yeah, we're, we're, we were kind of sort of think, start thinking about a va back. We talked about this before. Maybe a van conversion. Can we squeeze? And so we are actually going to look at a couple of van conversions on the weekend. Um, Unfortunately, <laughs> so unfortunately, they're kind of like on a um, Fiat base. Um, everything's on a Fiat base, is it? So the transit, you go up into the Mercedes Benz, you know, sort of like category, and obviously the the, the price goes like skyward. Um, you, you, you start going astronomical with Mercedes Benz. Do, um, you know. Uh, do, do we just need to rewind the clock five years, start fresh, be very, very, very vigilant on this journey with the Fiat Ducato, try and... You know, uh, what, do, what do you think guys what do you, what do you think have you if you've had issues with your fear to get have you are, are you feeling like i am are, are you feeling um a little bit sort of you know just like past the moment a little bit um i don't I don't know whether i'm i'm uh you know sort of being in the um engineering sort of thing you sort of like worry about them things and and believe it or not you know i, I and i know what people are going to say joff get yourself a a, a, a good break ring and i do, but i don't want to be recovered from um poland you know i mean or, or eastern germany in the winter i don't want to you know i want you know th there's loads of places i still want to sort of go and um and i just don't want um the pain honestly the pain that we suffered the mental torture was i need total reliability and maybe a fresh start um, so I don't know what you think about that, guys. I I know we're going to maybe str everybody's going to say you are going to struggle. And we've had the kind of some talk about. So what am I going to say first of all? What I'm going to say first of all is obviously where, where I actually park this motorhome here. Um, it's like a 90 degree turn in off the road. It can be a little bit teasy, even for a seven meter motorhome. I, I've done it a million times. Ma making a, a, a slightly shorter van conversion would make life so much easier for me getting in and out. Very, very quick access. That Just by chopping off um, what we're going to be chopping off, we're going to be chopping off like literally... Um, six uh six put um 60 centimeters six we're talking about 60 centimeters less than this fan and um yeah we're I'm, I'm sort of you know we've been like talking about it and um yeah and and we're sort of almost keen to sort of you know that let's are we ready for another journey let's sort of like try and 
deck it out, let's try and minimise down on certain stuff. Um, I'm, I'm sort of like feeling quite excited about that. And uh, it, yeah, um, what do you think? Drop us a comment. Um, we'll get further into it, this journey. I think I'm going to like sort of like talk about the, this journey a little bit more. We probably, so obviously the van will be a bit narrower and some of the um, middle sections might be a little bit tight for passing and stuff like that. Um, and we're, we're, we've seen one van and it kind of, the more we started looking at it, it's sort of got a, a big bed at the back. I'm not going to like, name it you're probably gonna probably maybe guess but um literally it's got a big bed at the back it's got loads of storage like underneath it you can get a gas low system in it um what else has it got it's got a sort of swing around bathroom and a shower i've actually looked again at one uh, one today a quick look at one today and the shower looks re it was a very very quick look and uh, i just wanted to get me head round the size of that shower we've been watching a lot of youtube videos and um yeah just like looking at all the the different and obviously the storage issues um we talked about previously about this van uh how the cup caroline does actually struggle with some of these top cupboards getting like um uh, cooking ingredients down uh saucepans in these cupboards i'm always like taking them down and passing them out um so there is a few sort of things that we're thinking that we might be able to just make our life a little bit easier. Um, just a, uh, a few little bits and pieces. A lot of fireworks going off tonight. So, yes, fireworks. Fireworks at Mo Hotel Adventures. But, um, yeah, so that's how we are feeling at the moment, guys. I hope you... Um, sort of probably can just sort of like uh take on board what i'm trying to put over possibly and uh leave us a comment um yeah a little bit more kind of maybe stealthy you know a little bit more not so white and motorhome stood out um body shell um yeah just sort of uh we're feeling it a little bit like yeah maybe um uh what else was i going to say there's there's a few things um that we sort of like we we're like talking about and we sort of okay we know there might be some compromises in certain places but for us there seems to be a few pluses as well um obviously oh one was one of the big pluses was the bed at the back very big like bed at the back and the windows out the back so we don't actually get that with the motor around we look at the sides but as actually there's been a few times when we've sort of said do you know what if we had like you know that iconic picture that everybody does on instagram of opening the back doors and looking out and we've been in them places where we've sort of said about this and that is one thing that we've not experienced obviously with this motorhome the other thing i'm going to say guys is this particular one the sliding door on the side has got like two places where it stops when you open it so it goes halfway so almost shut the kitchen is over that side um and it stops halfway so if you're kind of like cooking with the door open you're sort of like you, you you've got that kind of like little bit of wind protection if there's like a breeze you've still got a little bit of protection with the door but and then fully opening the door um we're, we're sort of thinking well imagine like so we've got a heart to a door in this one and uh, obviously it's quite wide compared to some motor homes um but we've never kind of had that experience where you're almost outside of it, you're inside the van but you're kind of like you feel almost like you're part of the outside as well you you know where i'm do you know where i'm coming from <laughs> so, so um yeah we, we've never kind of experienced that and we've been in some incredible places again where you park like um sideways and that you i just i'm just you know i'm getting quite excited I'm, I'm getting a bit hyped about this because i'm just imagining some of the places that we park um lakes seas in austria where you're kind of like looking out the door and you're just like pinching like and just imagine having that whole door wide open and just sitting back and uh you know you've got the the the, the kettle boiling um sort of a bit 
bit bit van life <laughs> so yeah I tell you, so the, I'm, I'm gonna leave this video there guys please leave us a comment um, we're we're always about like comments you know the score guys and um, we'll sit we're gonna keep you updated you know how, like passionate we are about this situation and um, I've bit I've been a little bit not 100 um, you know just it, it's been a bit of a bit of a bit of a one of them so um you know i'm thinking caroline's like is it you know we'll just keep asking ourselves do we need to um get something fresh get something get get, get our teeth into something else and uh, we've almost pulled everything together here and uh, you know probably made the ultimate traveling machine um and uh will we regret it i don't know uh hopefully not but uh, we'll see what happens. We're a long way off yet. Um, we don't even know what colour it's going to be. But see you on the next video, guys.